Yo, what up, though? So Michigan will be playing Minnesota, man, this weekend. And the little brown jug bowl, man. Can the Minnesota Gophers finally take home the little brown jug? No. I don't see it happening, man. The little brown jug will remain in Michigan, man. The little brown jug will stay in Michigan, man. Because Michigan will beat the brakes off of Minnesota. Let's just be for real. The last two opponents Michigan played, I want to say they both were Big Ten, and they both only put up seven. And I say Minnesota will keep that trend going, man. The Minnesota Gophers, man, <laughs> they lost to North Carolina 31-13, to and they lost to – who did they lose to? They lost to Northwestern, man. 34 to 37. I can see Michigan, man, easily pulling up 47 points compared to Minnesota 7. <laughs> this will be an old-fashioned beatdown, man. Hardball is back again. Y'all seen how Michigan played last week when Hardball was in town. They covered the, spring, the point spread and everything, man. This week again, Michigan will cover the point spread and they will go over the total points, man. Because Minnesota Gophers, man, not a good football team. I ain't never seen the Minnesota Gophers being a good football team. I'm not going to lie to y'all. And the Little Brown Jug will stay here in Michigan, man. The Michigan Gophers will not see that Little Brown Jug until the end of the game where they will take it and give it to Michigan, man. That with a Little Brown Jug. The Little Brown Jug is going to stay home here at Michigan, man. Michigan this year, I think, is on the mission, man. I'm not going to lie to y'all. I've been looking at a lot of college football, man. Georgia don't look good. Georgia might lose to Kentucky this weekend. Let's be for real. Georgia don't look good at all, man. Ohio State, uh, Michigan on. We we got them anyway. I ain't worried about Ohio State. Who else? Washington, that's a, ni that's a nice college team. USC, man, they ain't got no defense, and their offense is okay. Man, don't ain't no team right now scare me in college football that I think will get Michigan problems. I'm gonna be for real with y'all. Like Georgia, yeah, but Georgia, man, I'm, I'm seeing a lot of shit in Georgia that I just don't like. And Michigan right now, if they play Georgia next week, Michigan will beat Georgia, man. Let's be for real. Kentucky is about to beat Georgia come Saturday. So I got Michigan tank taking care of uh, Minnesota, man. And Georgia going to lose to Kentucky. So, Michigan will be ranked number one after this weekend, man. Write it down. Take a picture. Screenshot this. After this weekend, Michigan will be ranked number one in the college football ranking, man. And we're going to keep that little brown jug here in Michigan. Minnesota Gophers ain't got nothing coming this weekend, man. They only beat Michigan, I think, in a total three times throughout the whole little rivalry. They got. It's, it's not even a rivalry. A rivalry when y'all go back and forth. Michigan's just been stomping Minnesota for so many years. I don't know why they call this a rivalry. The arrival to Michigan will be Ohio State. It won't be no damn Minnesota Gophers, man. The Minnesota Gophers, man, been trashed for years and about to get stumped Saturday, man. And I see another thing on the internet, too, man. If Urban Migers going to Michigan State, Man, I'm going to make a video about that, dude. Ooh, if Urban Myers is coming back to the Big Ten, I ain't going to lie to y'all. If he go to Michigan State, it's going to be trouble. Because Urban Myers, man, gave Michigan the flux when he was in Ohio State. I'm not going to lie to y'all. But Michigan win big this weekend, man. They cover the point spread, and they go over the total points, man. And Georgia lose this weekend, and Michigan will be ranked number one in the college football ranking, man. Take a picture. Write it down, screenshot it, man. I know what I'm talking about. 